reducible equation to a quadratic form so in this regard we are going to reduce the given equation which is in not in the form of a quadratic form by substituting similar polynomial in the given equation by means of a constant letter in order to get in the form of a quadratic that is in the quadratic form or in other words a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0 form. So, we are going to discuss this reducible equation to quadratic form in an advanced level. Whereas, in this regard let us perform one illustration. So, as to reduce the given equation to a quadratic form. Here we reduce the given equation to a quadratic form that is a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0, where a is not equals to 0 and b comma c belongs to the real constants. by substituting a proper polynomial by another variable so now let us illustrate so one of the illustration so as to prove how to reduce a an equation into the form of a quadratic one so here in this regard solve x into x plus 1 into x plus 2 into x plus 3 is equals to 120. So, this is the given equation which is not in the form of a quadratic that is a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0 this is not in the form of a quadratic that is a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0, but we have to bring it in the form of a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0 or in other words the quadratic form. So, here the solution starts now as per problem the given equation is of x into x plus 1 into x plus 2 into x plus 3 is equals to 120, but that implies. So, I am going to replace the terms. So, here the first factor is of x, the second factor is of x plus 1, then the third factor is of x plus 3, and the fourth one is of x plus 3. 
So, x into x plus 1 into x plus 2 into x plus 3, first one is of x, the second one is of x plus 1, third one is of x plus 2 and the fourth one is of x plus 3. I am going to rearrange these factors such as, so here x into the first and the last and whereas, the middle together. Then now, so x into x plus 3 and then second and the third that is x plus 1 into x plus 2 is equals to 120. By rearranging, we got this logical step by rearranging the terms on the left hand side. Then now, so here I want to multiply the first and the second and this third and the fourth separately by multiplying separately. So, here x must be multiplied with x first of all then x x with 3. So, here that implies that implies x into x plus 1 x plus 3 into x plus 1 into x plus 2 is equals to 120 is the previous logical step. Whereas, here we are going to multiply first 2 and the last 2 separately, then the next logical step will be off. So, x must be multiplied with each and every term of the second exp expression. So, x into x is of x square plus x into 3 is of 3 x within the brackets and whereas, here to multiply the sec third and the fourth expressions. So, first of all we have to multiply the fourth expression by means of third expressions first term that is x. So, x multiplied with the complete bracket that is x plus 2 which is the fourth expression plus second term of the third expression is of 1 multiplied with the complete bracket that is x plus 2 which is of the fourth bracket that is fourth expression bracket close that is equals to 120 which is on the right hand side. So, that implies x square plus 3 x is written as it is then now say here is in the square brackets I have to multiply x with complete x plus 2 in order to multiply x with x plus 2 first of all we have to multiply x with x then later with 2 here also the same x 1 with x then 1 with 2 then the next logical step will be of x into x is of x square plus x into 2 is of 2 x plus 1 into x is of 1 x plus 1 2 is of 2 bracket close then that is equals to 120 on the other hand that is R H S. So, that implies x square plus 3 x bracket close then now here I want to simplify the like terms. So, x terms are of 2. So, these are the two like terms second degree term is of only 1 that is x square let us write it as as it is. So, x square written as it is then now here x terms are of 2 similar terms. So, let us simplify. So, plus of plus is plus let us add up 2 plus 1 is of 3 x. So, among 1 and 2. So, 2 is greater than 1 2 sign is of positive therefore, 3 3 x assess the sign of positive plus 2 the last term is written as it is bracket close that is equals to 120 as it is on the right hand side. So, let us write x square plus 3 x within the bracket that is within the brackets of the square that is square brackets, but here by observing. So, here we are going to perform this problem or we are finding the solution to this problem or in other words we are going to find out the variable that is x value by means of the reducible. So, here we are going to reduce this entire equation which is not in the form of a quadratic into a quadratic form that is in the form of a x square plus b x plus c equals to 0, but in order to reduce into the quadratic form. So, we have to substitute here that is x square plus x here within the second term. So, we are having x square plus x that is the common expression is of x square plus 3 x. So, let us I mean substitute let let us replace or substitute x square plus 3 x by another variable that is a. So, here that implies 
x square plus 3 x must be replaced by means of a. So, here put x square plus 3 x equals to a then then we have x square plus 3 x into x square plus 3 x within the bracket plus 2 bracket close that equals to 120 implies this is the previous logical step which we had the same logical step can be written in the form of is by replacing x square plus 3 x as a. So, here x square plus 3 x must be replaced by means of a square bracket then x square plus 3 x must be replaced by means of a then plus 2 within the square bracket then that equals to 120 on the other hand that is right hand side. So, here in order to simplify further so complete bracket that is a plus 2 must be multiplied with a. So, first of all we have to multiply a with a then later with a with 2 then the next logical step will be of that implies a into a is of a square plus a into 2 is of 2 a then that equals to 120 on the other hand. So, that implies a square plus 2 a. So, here by transposing so here 120 that is positive to the over to the left hand side 120 is of positive when it is transposed over to the left hand side then plus 120 on the other hand becomes minus 120 which is equated to none of the term is left over on the right hand side therefore, 0 is on the right hand side. So, here we got this step by transposing so we have transposed plus 120 over to the left hand side by transposing right hand side term to left hand side based upon this reason so I got this logical step. So, here the logical step is of a square plus 2 a minus 120 equals to 0. So, we framed in the gen form of a quadratic that is a square plus b x plus c equals to 0. So, here that implies a square plus 2 a minus 120 equals to 0 which is in the form of. So, that implies a x square plus b x plus c is equals to 0. So, this is the gen form that is the general form of a quadratic equation.